word is problematic causing a lot of problems or full of problems so it can also be said that problematic means troublesome worrisome so something which cause problems we can say a child is problematic which means a child is causing problems for either teacher or other students or his parents or her parents so we can say he is troublesome or he is problematic in rural areas it can be problematic to get around without a car so rural here means the areas which are away from cities for example um, villages or townships so these are the areas which are called rural areas which are underdeveloped or less developed so in such areas obviously if a person does not have a car it will be difficult to move around places the next word is waterway waterway can be called as any water body which can be a lake a river or a canal through which boats or ships can travel to and fro so it says the nile river is a major waterway many boats travel on it so basically when boats travel from a uh, sea inward or towards the sea they have to use any channel or canal so nile river is a really major waterway here you can see the picture of the waterway as you can see the boats here as well along the sides and it is wide enough to carry any boat or ship not ship basically but a small size ship or a boat or a cruise maybe to for uh, for either cargo purposes or for passengers you know for people to move from one place to another or to transport things from one place to another the next word is explosive explosives are any substances that can explode that can blow up that can cause an explosion or a blast they used explosive to to blow up old building as you can see here we have the uh, picture of explosive with the timer you might have seen in movies or cartoons that we have a timer set for the explosive and when the timer ticks the thing blows up and it usually causes a, a blast and noisy obviously as well the next word is link link means a connection when we link two things which means we connect two things to make or suggest a connection between two or more things or people so we can link people we can link things we can, we can link people as in we can ask them to be our friends or to be each other friends for example i decided to link my computer to my friend's printer here let's see the computer a is linked with the wi-fi router through a cable and to a printer as well through a cable so these is this, this these are physically connected physically wired physically linked with each other and here on the other side computer b is wirelessly linked with the wi-fi router through the help of the wi-fi signals so link can be a physical connection between the things as well as uh, distant link as well the next word is span span means the length of something from one end to another for example i say from this point this point towards the end of the screen we have approximately 10 inches so i can say my screen is 10 inches wide or the span of my screen is 10 inches for example the span of this bridge is over 300 meters which means the bridge is 300 meters long you can see in this picture from my thumb to my um, lady finger we have or we can also say pinky finger we have this line going which means it measures the distance from one finger to another I can say the length of my palm is so and so for example 5 inches or 6 inches so we can say this is a span a span of length we can also have a span of time which means for example if I have to say I waited for my friend um, or put it this way uh, an hour is a 
big span of time to wait for someone so which means a span of time describes the length of time how long did a person wait or do something okay guys now you have come across all the words and their meanings and sample sentences so let's do a quick exercise and review all of them complete the sentences some so words are given to you situation link suspended overcome support and varied let's see what the sentences are we used large beam to dash the roof now what are used what are beams used for to support the roof the next one is when i lost my keys it was a problematic dash okay when a person loses his or her keys he is very chaotic and very worrisome so problematic what situation it was a problematic situation the next is the land here is dash there are fields mountains and rivers which means it has a variety fields mountains and rivers the land here is varied having variety the cables were dashed from the towers along the bridge okay so it means he's talking about the suspension bridges because it is linking cables with bridge so what it can be the cables were suspended from the towers along the bridge fifth is to be successful you will have you will have to dash many obstacles all right we have already studied the connection of obstacles with one of the words and that is overcoming the obstacles we have to overcome obstacles to be successful the the new bridge will dash our community to the rest of the city okay bridges are a connections which uh, which connect one place to another so which means connections are links so the new bridge will link our community to the rest of the city students this is an exercise from page 16 of your book so you should complete this on your books as well moving on to the next exercise this is also from page 16 of your book true and false circle true or false the very first sentence is a wall in your path can be an obstacle either true or false if you are going straight on your path on your road or anywhere and if a wall appears in front of you obviously you cannot go past through it so it is obviously an obstacle it is true second is many rivers near cities are busy waterways true or false as you know that if cities have rivers and they are metropolitans big cities they must their waterways will also be very busy and hustling with boats and ship, ships coming in and going out carrying either passengers or cargoes or you know freight as we have learned the word freight so it is also true the third sentence is explosives are usually quiet now this is very clear very obvious that when an explosion happens it basically does not cause uh, silence but it causes noise so this is false when blasts happens it is very noisy the next is a span is the distance between two things a span is the distance between two things and we've already studied that the distance from one place to another is called a span so either true or false this is true students you should also copy this on your books okay students thank you so much that was the end of lesson number 5 i hope you're coping up with your studies and understanding everything with this we come to the end and see you next time allah hafiz